let me tell y'all about this hair that I am rocking. Hey everyone. So these are natural hair clip-ins from the company K-Long Hair, and this is exactly how it arrived to me in a brown envelope. Now it's supposed to be seven pieces of hair clip-ins, but here's the catch. I got eight. So this is the hair in its natural state. It was described as 4C natural hair clippings, but this is more of a 4A if you really look at it, but I found a quick solution to it. I decided to spray some water on them and add some olive oil to it as well and finger comb it out until I get more coils than I do curls. But be careful, the more you separate the curls, the frizzier it gets. I overdid it a little bit, but it actually turned out to match with my own natural hair. So this is what the hair looked like before, and this is what it looks like after I've done finger combed it. So I'm now unraveling my own hair. This is a freshly done twist out that I allow to dry overnight. I'm separating them multiple times to get a little body there. Now my own natural hair is actually very thin. It lacks body. I have the length, but I have no body. So that was the purpose of these clip-ins. So this is my hair. Unfortunately, it sticks straight out. And as you can see, my shrinkage is horrible. Now the front part of my hair is a lot less coily so I can actually get it to lay down just a tad bit. So here's my epic fail of a twist out. Sorry y'all, ain't no curls here. Kinks all throughout, straight from the motherland. So taking a piece of clip-in, at this point they're partially dry, I'm going to take the longest piece and stick it right down on top of my natural hair, in the middle of my head. It's almost like pinning down a hair clip and they stay right in place. I'm giving it a tug so you guys can see the quality as well. I'm just sectioning off parts of my hair and pinning down the clip-in where I would like to have the length. Now for this style, I'm going to do a side part. It takes a bit of trial and error to figure out exactly where you would like the clip-ins to lay down, but once you figure it out, you kind of get the hang of it. You just want to make sure that towards the front of your hair, you have enough leave out to cover the tracks. And finally, I'm just laying my leave out right on top of the tracks. Like, wow, you can't even tell that majority of this is not even my real hair. Now for the remainder of the video, I'm gonna show you all four different ways to style these clippings with your natural hair. Hope you enjoy.
Thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe, and stay tuned. Now, the reviews for this hair, a lot of people stated that it got frizzy and matted and they weren't able to revert it. Let me show you all the trick. We're going to revert it.